back to my channel. So today I'm here with five tips on Friday. For you all, it's like, oh, and cheers. I can't believe that this is actually my 95th five tips on Friday. So I hope you guys enjoyed this helpful video and let's just jump right into it. Okay, so the first tip is, do you need another way to dry out that zit? Well, I bet you never thought about grabbing your deodorant stick and slapping it on that bad boy. <laughs> Because deodorant is known for drying, why not try it on your zit? You know, it keeps you dry throughout the entire day so then you don't sweat. Why not put it on your zit so then you don't sweat there? <laughs> Just make sure that you use a clean deodorant that you don't use under your dirty armpits. <laughs> well, unless you have clean armpits. I mean, like, I would still recommend getting a different deodorant for your face. Okay, so the next tip is, do you ever get nail polish all over your cuticles when you paint your nails? And you're like trying to paint them perfectly and they always get on your cuticles and you're like, well, no need to worry about that anymore. I just need to go right ahead and grab some Elmer's glue, put it around all around your nails, like all around where your cuticle is. Let it dry, and then paint your nails like you normally would. When you are done painting your nails, just go right ahead and pull off the Elmer glue around your cuticle, and then boom, you will have perfect nails without having it all on your cuticle. Who knew Elmer's glue could help with such a perfect manicure? Okay, so the next tip is, do you ever find that you get paper cuts, especially in school or work, and you have, like, no banding, and they hurt so bad? It's just like, you're like, oh my gosh, my finger hurts me so bad, and then your friend's like, what is, what's wrong with you? Like, I got a paper cut, it's like, it's such a tiny cup, but it's like burning your entire finger. Well, if you have this problem too, just go ahead and grab some chapstick, also known as the good friend lip balm. <laughs> Rub your lip balm right on to your paper cuts and it will make the pain disappear instantly. So next time you get a paper cut in school or work, grab that lip balm, rub it right on there, and your pain will be disappeared instantly. Okay, so the next tip is, do you have trouble putting on a bracelet by yourself and there's nobody around to help you put it on and you're like, I really want to wear this bracelet but there's no way that I can get it on by myself. No worries, you can still wear that adorable bracelet without having somebody help you put it on. Just go right ahead and grab a paper clip and unbend it like this. So all you want to do is just want to go right ahead and grab a paper clip, bend it like this, pull it through the o-ring in the bracelet to hold it in place, hold the paper clip with the other hand as the same bracelet is on, then wrap the other hand just as snap close in place and you are finished. And there you go, you are able to wear your favorite bracelet without having somebody to put it on. No relying on anybody. So the last tip I absolutely love. I have a one minute hair makeover for you. If you want your hair to look longer and your hair just seems like it's never looking longer in any style that you do, then follow this one minute hair tutorial. So look longer and fuller instantly. All you do is need two rubber bands. It's as simple as that. And the sister. Yes, I'm gonna show it on my sister. So the first thing you want to do is just want to go right ahead and section off your hair into like a half up, half down hairstyle. And I'm actually using my sister to do this example on so you guys can really see what I'm doing. But I'm just going to section it off into a half up, half down hairstyle, then grabbing a rubber band and pulling that hair through and putting that into a ponytail. Flipping that half up, half down hairstyle forward and then pulling the rest of the hair up into another ponytail, like this. Flipping the first hair ponytail over top of the other one and there you go! Your hair looks longer and fuller instantly. See how easy that was? Thank you so much, Ashley, for being my model. So there you have it. Your hair will look instantly in no time. And if you're like wanting it to grow and you want it to look longer, try that hairstyle and it will look longer and fuller. And that's all that concludes my 95th Five Tips on Friday. I hope you guys enjoyed this helpful video. And if you did, definitely go right ahead and give it a thumbs up. And be sure to stay tuned for next week's great tips because more tips are coming your way. I'll talk to you later. I love you guys so very much. Also, be sure to come back tomorrow to my channel for our Alpha of the Day. Everyone has a wonderful, great night, evening, wherever you are. And I love you millions. 
Oh, and by the way, be sure to check out my outfit of the day if you guys want to see what I'm wearing in this entire video. Be sure to check out my outfit of the day for today. There will be a link right here. You can just click on my head or something to go right ahead and get directly to that video. And be sure to subscribe. So now I just look extremely creepy in this little box.